so good. God is so good. God is so good. He's so good to me and you and you and you and you and even you. That's right, boys and girls. Good morning and welcome to Bible Study Fellowship. I'm Miss Kelly and I'm here to tell you a story from Hosea today that is in this Bible. God's true word. Everything in this is true and this book is full of God's promises. Isn't that so exciting? Yes, so exciting. God is listening. God is listening to every word I say. He can hear me. He can hear me every time I pray. Boys and girls, let's pray. Father God, thank you so much for all these boys and girls and moms and dads and any adults in the room that are watching and listening today. I just ask that you quiet their minds and open their hearts so that they can hear your true word today. And we ask all these things in your name, Jesus. Amen. All right, boys and girls, can you come closer? Come a little closer. I want to tell you something. Are you listening? God will never stop loving his people. The Bible tells us God is love. That's right. God is love. So that means God will love his people forever and ever, even when God's people are doing wrong. That's right. And people in Israel, they were doing wrong things. And God's people, they didn't want to do what God said. God did not stop loving them, but it did make God sad. There was a man named Hosea that understands God's sadness. Hosea was a prophet who gave God's message to people. Hosea had a wife named Gomer. He loved his wife so much, but she didn't love him back. And that made Hosea sad. One day, Gomer ran away and sinned against God and Hosea. She ended up very sick and hungry and all alone. God told Hosea to go save Gomer, even though she had sinned. Hosea obeyed God and brought Gomer home. He cleaned her up. He gave her food and water. He took very good care of Gomer and loved her. The people of Israel, they were just like Gomer. They were running away from God, not loving him. And God told them there would be trouble because of all the wrong things they were doing. But God promised he would still love them. God sent his son, Jesus, to bring people back to God. Jesus is the most amazing way God shows us his love. All right, boys and girls, were you listening really good? I have some questions for you. Okay, our first question is, who did a Hosea obey? That's right. He obeyed God. Good job, boys and girls. Okay, this is a really, really hard one. Let's see if you guys were listening. Who was Hosea's wife? Did I hear you say Gomer? That's right. Gomer was Hosea's wife. Okay, and the last one. Who will never stop loving his people? That's right, boys and girls. God will never stop loving his people because God is love. All right, boys and girls. Now we're going to move on to our scripture verse. And today's scripture verse is Hosea 14, 4a. And I was thinking we could sign the verse. So our verse today, Hosea 14, 4a is, I will love them freely. So I'm going to show you how to sign it. And then we're going to do it together. So I is pointing to yourself, will love them freely or freely. All right, boys and girls, are you ready? I will love them freely. Hosea 14, 4a. Let's do it one more time, maybe two. I will love them freely. Hosea 14, 4a. One more time, guys. 
I will love them freely. Hosea 14, 4a. Wow, you guys are amazing. You're so good at signing. Are you guys ready for music time? I sure am. All right, let's start with praise him. Let's praise God. And we're gonna use some hand gestures. First, first we're gonna put our hands in the air to praise him. Then we're gonna love him. Then we're gonna thank him. All right. Praise him, praise him, all you little children. God is love, God is love. Praise him, praise him, all you little children. God is love, God is love. God loved Hosea and Gomer. Love him, love him, all you little children. God is love, God is love. Love him, love him, all you little children. God is love, God is love. And Gomer was mean to Hosea. Thank him, thank him, all you little children. God is love, God is love. Thank him, thank him, all you little children. God is love, God is love. And God told Hosea to love Gomer anyway. All right, let's move on to trust and obey. Can you guys get your O's ready? O is for obey, you remember that? Trust and obey, for there's no other way to be happy in Jesus, but to trust and obey. Hosea did what God said. Let's clap now. Trust and obey, for there's no other way to be happy in Jesus, but to trust and obey. Hosea never stopped loving God. Let's do finger taps. Trust and obey, for there's no other way to be happy in Jesus, but to trust and obey, and God never stops loving his people. Thank you, Jesus, for that. And I'm so glad you guys joined me today. We'll see you next time. Bye-bye.